Hi Dress Up Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw a Mickey Mouse Squishmallow. So let's get started. To draw cute Mickey, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a circle. And I'm going to come right across and draw another circle. Say about right here. Just giving myself enough space for a little nose. There. So then let's come back in here and I'm going to make them draw so two eyes. So two small circles inside for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom and same thing over here. So if you love this Mickey um, Squishmallow, definitely check out my mini that I just drew. Minnie Mouse uh, Squishmallow and of course all my other Squishmallows that I've drawn so far. Now that the eyes are done, let's come back right in the center and we're going to draw the nose. So right here. Just draw a small little oval. I'm going to start with a curve, round it off on the sides, and same thing at the bottom. And I'll come in here and just put in a little highlight, so just another oval, and then just shade everything else in black. There. Okay, so then now that we have the eyes and nose in, let's go ahead and draw Mickey's face. So I'm going to come, let's say about right here where the eyes are, come out a little bit, about right here. Just a little bit, I give myself a point. So same thing over here, just drag a point across, approximately about right here, come towards the bottom of the eye. And from there, I'm gonna start the cheeks. So I'm gonna come out with a curve, shallow curve, because we're just going to draw a shallow curve underneath the nose. So draw two curves and then I'm just going to go ahead and bring this curve down. And about right there, I'll go ahead and connect it. There. Now we're going to draw the top. So I'm going to come to the center, come straight up. Just imagining this big curve around the eye. So right in the center, say, I'll just give myself a point about right here. And because it's easier for my hand to go down, I'm gonna go up from here and then come all the way down and around and come right back to my point. Just smooth out my curve. So just notice everything is pretty flush right here. So let's do the same thing. We're just gonna go up and I'm just gonna drag a point across, just approximate so I know it's about the same height right here. And come all the way around, just like the other side, back to my point. There. Okay. So now we have Mickey's face framed in. Now we can go ahead and draw the Squishmallow shape. So I'll come to say about right here. It's easier in my hand. I'll come out just a tiny bit, not too much. And I'm going to come all the way around. So it's all up to you how you want to start. But this part kind of about right here is our center. So this will be our highest point about right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and draw this curve all the way around. Just like the other side, about right there. And I'll bring this all the way down now. So we're just going to basically draw this ovalish shape for our Squishmallow. And continue this all the way down. It's just like drawing this very tall dumpling shape <laughs> that I usually give to all my characters, but it's just much taller. So about right there, I'll go ahead and bring it in and 
curve and flatten out at the bottom. There, now it's all done. Now let's come back up to the top in this area and draw the ears. So nice big ear, so about right here, just go ahead and draw this big curve for Mickey's ears. Come back about right there. Nice and round. And I'll do the same thing on the other side. So to make it easier, I'm gonna drag this point across and this point across since I'm drawing pretty big. And that way I kind of know where to go. So once again, I'm just gonna go up and I'll drag this point across about right there, just so I know it's about the same height. So these are just little tips you can use when you're drawing pretty big and you want to be accurate as possible. Come right back to your point. And no, it won't be exactly the same. We just want it to be approximate. So these points definitely help. Okay, there, finally now it looks like Mickey Mouse, right? So let's come back for some details on the body. I'll say about right here, give myself a point, come right across once again. So it's just easier for me to draw this curve all the way across. Now I know to come back up. Oops, <laughs> and I missed. There. Okay, and then um, that's pretty much it, except we're going to draw two ovals right here. So right in the center, come out. Another right here, I'll start one. One oval, come right across about right here and draw my other oval. And that's pretty much it for our Mickey Mouse here from Squishmallows. But of course, before I go, I'm gonna add a little heart right here, just like I did on Minnie. To make it my draw so cute Mickey Mouse from Squishmallows. So there, I really hope I made this fun and easy for you to follow along with me and inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.